I if these guys are like sitting next to each other or what? Uh, I think it's head to head, right? Okay, okay. <laughs> yeah. You, you were you were yeah. about to impersonate him. I heard the voice. Uh, I'm looking. I, you know, I was gonna, but I thought, let me not, let me not, man. Let me be professional. I got a blazer on, man. I got a blazer. I'm looking nice. I'm looking professional, bro. Do you know what I'm saying? So now nah, I'm not gonna do bro, that. Bro, shit. bro, bro. What time is it where you're at? What time is it? Tell me. Tell it's me. Like, it's like it's 8:20 a.m., bro. It's 8 bro, do it. You could do it if you want. You you've been you've been putting in the work. I I don't know why he's dancing. What what is he doing? It's the to <laughs> tournament. I. Is it? A, is he praying? This is what we do when we go to the mosque. Okay, let's, ladies and lads, <laughs> let's go. Let's go. I didn't know Arsene was on commentary. Thanks, guys. For man, he's he's a, he's a multi-talented guy. Yeah, you're welcome. Thank you. All right, let's go. Zafina versus Eddie. So he's already played against Chanel's. Um, it's Zafina, Chanel's yeah. Zafina, but this is a different Zafina right here, man. Different style. He's gonna have to adapt to. Bro, you gotta tell me. Does Pakistan have Eddie players? They have one. His name is. He's actually a commentator as well, called Siki. And I remember when I was in Pakistan, like there was a lot of guys that didn't really know the matchup that well. I was getting a lot uh -oh. of success versus some players. So, but remember Arslan Ash versus John Ding at Evo. He managed to get the win, so he has experience here. Yeah, he does have experience again, but they're different players. Let's find mm -hmm. out if he has Sir experience. All right. Because I'll tell you straight up, John Ding and Sir play very different. Mhm. Mm a hundred percent. Already had the live feed here. That's gonna be difficult to get back. Uh oh. Got him. What are you looking at? Mm -hmm. Bro, this is sick. Mm -hmm. Best players in the world going at it. That's it, man. Top four action here. Lose the semi-finals, man. All to play for as well. And just to let you guys know, there is a thousand dollars in the difference between third and fourth. So you can essentially say this is a one thousand dollar money match. Oh yeah, it's a big one. The follow up mm -hmm. here, is he gonna get the hit? No, the follow up, he's, oh, he has to be careful. Time is a wasting. Uh oh. Time I is like a wasting. 4 3, interesting. Oh! oh! He almost stole, he almost stole it away. He almost stole it away. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, sir. Showing that he's still very, very dangerous. <coughs> okay. Good luck. Oh, nice punish. Yeah, 1 plus 2. That's not what... Um, Chanel was trying to go for a different punish there. But the 1 plus 2 has a bit more range. So nice from Ruslan. Mantis pressure. Not... Doesn't have any rage right now. But Sir's trying to push Ruslan to the wall. Here we go. No break. What's the Oki down to? Nice. Yeah, good. So basically, if you do, if you stay on the ground after that one plus two throw, or you back roll, down two will hit you. So uh, Arslan knew that Sir probably had a, had an idea about that. So side roll, beat the side roll with a power crush. Uh oh, here we go. The follow up gets the big launch, pushing towards it. Let's see what he does. Yeah. What is the mix at the wall? Arslan's patient, not gonna fall for that forward four. Yeah. Oh, nice, nice. This is looking good, Sir. Mm -hmm. Just looking like it's going to be Sir's round unless the rage drive can come in clutch for Arslan, but no, down 4-3, going to close it out. That is his bit of choice towards the end of the rounds. I've noticed he's been using it in great succession as well. Yeah. You know, we got to be very careful as well for Arslan because Eddie's actually the only character that can sidestep the, the Scarecrow Wampus 2 after getting hit by 1-3. Like, it's weird how Eddie's sidestep can work sometimes. Yeah, I don't think it's a sidestep, it's his rhythm, it's his Jenga that he has. Mm. Oh, here we go. Arslan taking that. I would say rather cleanly. I feel like he was pretty confident here. There were moments where the momentum was in Sir's favor, but Arslan didn't really crack. Yeah. Look at no, that sad face. Look at that sad face. He's fe is he is he feeling defeated? I'm not, like, Rematch ball. He, he might have put a bit too much energy into that. Into that. I figured no, out. I figured. Box. I figured out what the SER stands for. What's it stand for, Mark? Some Eddie rematcher. <laughs> I figured it out. I was saving it in my in my bank of dad jokes. I finally figured it out. I like it, man. All right, all right. Here we go. Gets the hit. The follow up there. Gets the four, four, four as well. Big damage boost. The, but the counter hit one plus two. We're going the other way. Here comes oh, yeah. Arslan. Gonna break it. Go downstairs. We're gonna go tarantula. Yes. A A guaranteed. Yeah, not only that, puts you in prime position for getting some more damage. Uh-oh. Okay, down 40. Woo, relaxed transition. 
Hang on. Hang on. Mix up time. Go to the mid. Nice. Very good death from Sir. Yeah, he was the, his persistence in like really forcing Arsene Ash to guess. That was great. Mm hmm. And he continue the four four. I don't know if that's what he wanted. Here we go. The follow up here. Maybe. Bam bam. Power crush. Okie dokie. Good block. Yeah. Got to low parry that though next time. For sure. That's what he does. Back to three counter hit. It's gonna hurt. It's not gonna kill though. What's the mix? Raid drive power? No. Yeah, the raid drive is keeping it dead. There we go. Catches him moving, sir. With the clutch every single time. I think Arstan becoming a bit too passive with the life lead, and sir is taking full advantage. I love it. The driver's high, able to land that. Oh, nice stuff here. Gotta watch out, man. Gotta watch out for the uh, the back dash of Eddie. I love the way he seamlessly just jumps in and transitions to that side step duplicate four as well. But mm -hmm. again, Zafina's just her spacing, her back dash, able to get out of dodge. Yeah. Ooh, here we go. Good block. Oh boy. Trying to do the follow up here. You're gonna have to be careful. Back to the wall. Ooh. Mm -hmm. This is looking so good for Sir. Doesn't even bother punishing the one plus two four. Just backing off now with a massive life lead. Arslan gets into range, beating him down on the floor. But the time becoming a factor. Oh yeah, he's gonna have to do something right now. The round lead, looking to tie it up. Is, is, is this any player really gonna beat one of the best in Pakistan? Oh, I think so. I think so. Can he do it? Oh, be careful. Oh, oh what a low parry. What was mm. that? That was crazy. There was a small opportunity there to potentially take the round if he had done the rage art against the back turn. But either way, sir, playing a very, very solid match there. One match apiece there. Oh my god. The Eddie dream continues. Only the strong. Is he going to go to the infinite? Do you really want to play an infinite versus Eddie? He's thinking hard. <laughs> I love it. What yeah. is he going to do? What is the situation here? The Eddie dream stays alive and the Eddie getting buffed dream dies with Sir doing so well with this character. But you know what? He just goes for the random select. He doesn't give a damn. Oh no, he's maybe he. I, I see his expression. Maybe he didn't want to pick st that stage. Let's see. I'm just gonna. We're just gonna confirm for you guys that this is gonna be the match, or we might be getting a reset. But if for now it is the Souk. And this is one of the things that I was so looking forward to watching. How Sir is going to be able to play against certain matchups. You know, matchups where people say, oh, this character is very good versus this character, you know. But he still manages to make it work because, you know, he, he uses every tool in Eddie's arsenal. Yeah, that's, I mean, that's the the value of being a specialist is like you you don't you don't try to beat a bad matchup by switching characters. You, you learn to deal with it. Yeah. Absolutely. But yeah, we are going to actually get a reset. I'm not sure. Yeah, I guess Arslan did not want to actually switch to this stage so um or he wanted to, or he wanted to switch characters maybe. maybe maybe yeah i just don't know what he would go for you know when it comes down to it the kunimitsu is the only other character that he's been actually using using i know that the leo he's brought out a couple of times in tournament but probably not the best choice against eddie um probably gonna stick with zafina here i don't see any reason to switch but the stage uh, is gonna be different for sure maybe okay. deciding to go to the infinite But it's all tied up. But look at that massive smile on Sir's face. He's just enjoying himself out there. And that's what it's all about, man. And he's definitely made a name for himself here. All you guys watching at home and me as well. Look, the peace signs are there. I'm not going <laughs> to forget this guy. He's, he's one of my favorite players right now, this guy. Man. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's been fun. We saw a lot of them throughout the, the past two days for sure. Mm. Definitely up there, man. But he has chosen to go to the infinite stage. Definitely. Okay, so... You know, Sir just clapping. I don't know, maybe he's happy about it as well. I was like, okay, you want to try and beat me in Infinite? Well, Chanel tried that already. It didn't work out too well for him. Here we go, ladies and lads. One match apiece. First of three action. Who's going to make it into top three? $1,000. The difference between third and fourth. Here we go. Yo, he got that back dash on lock. Mm hmm. I wonder if, he, if the backdash on P2 is as good as well. I mean, I feel like Arslan's been on P2 a lot here in these matches. Yeah. You know, usually it's not. <laughs> For most yeah, people. 
usually they have a stronger side. Mm -hmm. Not trying to put anyone in the spot, but I'd love to be proven wrong. <laughs> okay, down two, catch this. Good punish, wow. Ooh, Ooh. counter hit. The follow up here, he's gonna get the full combo as well. Yep. The mix up, oh, Arslan not falling for it. Yeah. Careful. Rage available, you know what's coming. There it is! Yo, the driver is high again, landing it. He is pretty good at landing that move. Yeah, he went from it after the down jab as well, so he had the plus frames. Six stuff, sir, is so clutch. How's he gonna deal with it? Working his way in, good block. Yeah. I feel like Sir does get a bit of a buff on this stage, man. You can see it. Loves to be able to use that Eddie backdash. He was Punish. so happy. Oh, he was so happy to get it there. Like, mm -hmm. he was clapping his hands. Like, oh, you're going to pick infinite stage on me? Let's go. He finishes the Scarecrow 2-2, two -two, so not going to get a full launch. Allowing Sir to potentially get back in. Big whiff, though. And the Punish. One match of each one round. Because we're all tied up. Even Stevens. Here we go. You guys are battling. Good break there on the throw. That's something that I really feel like Sir hasn't been tested on because no one's been attempting to grab him. Yeah. You know, any yeah, player is always moving. Gets the punish there. Yeah, just forget your legs. Arson trying to slow things down a little bit. Mm -hmm. FF3. Nice sidestep. You see that from Sir? He's aware. He's aware that he can he can actually sidestep the one plus two from Scarecrow, which other characters, no other character can do. Oh, what a clutch low parry there from Arslan. Mm -hmm. Now with the life lead here, caught him. This is gonna hurt, not gonna kill. Oh, oh my god, it could've been launched. That yeah. could've been launched. <gasps> Round four. That's the four, he, he knows it. You see the, the reaction on his face there. Mm -hmm. Gonna deal with all this again. Yeah. The down 3 3 not gonna get the float there. Mm -hmm. We haven't seen a great deal of lateral movement as well from Arslan. You know, the sidestepping Eddie's tracking pretty poor, but uh, sir, you know, he's he's doing a good job here either way. Oh. Look at this poking down, poking down, get the life feed running away now. Nice block. Mm -hmm. The low parry on the back numbers too. Yes, this is going to be a full combo. Now, this combo is going to be very difficult, especially because we've only got 15 seconds left. Oh, they traded. Uh oh. Hang on. Nice. Down four. I like the option there from Sir. Here we go. This is a big round for both of these players. Oh, oh he got it. Yes. The Sir special. You don't give a damn. No. Look Do at this. Get... Oh, he caught him. This is big. It's not going to kill, but of course, he's going to put him in a position where it's going to be hard to recover from. He again got greedy, went for the mid. Hey, he's not going to mind that at all. That's very little damage if you think about it. A nice block on that. Oh, punish. Ay. And like the, the low. hesitation. That was great. And look at our side. He is bewildered at the moment. <laughs> what happened there? He thought he had the launch afterwards. I feel like he just did it a little bit too slow. Yeah, I think. He tried to actually dash up into down 4 too. You haven't got that much time. And now Sir is one match away from moving into top 3 and eliminating Arslan. So definitely, like, I feel like there isn't a lot of... Uh, there aren't a lot of Eddies in Pakistan and he hasn't got a lot of practice. I played against Arslan with my own Eddie as well when he came to London. And I noticed that he didn't have the most experience. But, you know, Sir is doing a really good job in utilizing all of Eddie's moveset. The down back too, I mean, taking risks at the right time as well. This is definitely a puzzle that Arslan needs to solve. Yeah, and he has to do it very quickly because he is on uh, elimination point. If he loses this game, it's all over, right? Yep. I would have I would have thought going to a wall stage would have been better though, but he's sticking with the infinite. Fate is already decided. I mean, I, so, I, don't know, I don't know if he saw Sir cheering fight. that he had the infinite stage earlier. Yes, yeah, Sir definitely has been utilizing these um, the infinite so well. And again, Arslan not using back one plus two to punish the FF4. So there is definitely a gaps in knowledge there. 
He's just patient. He's not even going to mess with it. No, I don't want to deal with the punishment mix-up. I'm just going to let you do your thing. Mm -hmm. He's so happy to just get the life feed and chill. It's crazy. Yeah. Oh, he tried to go for it. I like it, but the recovery from Zafina a little bit too fast. Go for the low, and there's Arslan reacting again this time. Yeah. What crazy gameplay we're seeing here from Sir at the moment. Arslan hasn't been able to get anything massive, but there it is, the one plus two <laughs> counter hit. As soon as you say it, it happened. That's magic. <laughs> magic. That's the, cur the curse in full effect. Yep. Uh oh. Mmm, nice. Arslan on the board. Sir is making him work. Anybody's game. Start of the round. Again, both of these players looking for that big hit, looking for the advantage early on. That way they can start utilizing the movement to either get away or force the mix up. Mm -hmm. Ooh, out of range. Yeah, that's a case of the Eddie backdash maybe being a bit too good, right? Gets yep. himself way out of range. There we go, the Mantis down for two. So Arslan starting to stri string together some stuff here. Has the life lead. Mm -hmm. Down three. Oh, oh, hang on. This time going for the mid option. Arslan not falling for it. Feels like he's ahead of the game in terms of the mix up. No time left. Arson's just gonna chill. Yeah, goes for the up, up, a forward one plus two into Tarantula. Sir wasn't able to deal with it. Have we got a two rounds up? Arslan looking good, but it's not over yet. Sir has made so many reverse sweeps this weekend. Can you do it again? Ooh, he got caught out of the air that time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, how is he gonna deal with this? Arson is now feeling, feeling good the way that he's going and he's approaching, but it gets launched that time. Good no, no, there you go. That's guaranteed. That. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oldest trick in the book. Yeah, you 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 definitely got to take that. Try to go for the reset. Nice block on the low. Rage drive available now. Sir is definitely aware of that. What can you do, man? Look at this. Arslan trying to base something out. The patience. Oh, oh he got him. It's it's he's dead. That is unfortunate. He mm. let go too soon. Like a deer in headlights. Tried to whiff punish too early, and that's a case of the reactions being a bit too good from Sir. And yes, getting hit by the second hit. Arslan definitely getting away with that one. And we are going to the stage select. We're going to now. random select. We're going to random select, baby. Oh Let's yeah. Go. Mishima building to close it off. I love it. Sir, what a statement he has made. Can he make it to top three? But either way. Definitely a name to remember. This Eddie from Japan has been putting in the work. Can he eliminate one of the world's best players here? Pakistan's Arslan Ash. Yeah, he's definitely put in work throughout the entire weekend. Not only winning yesterday's qualifier, but going through so many of the great players today. He lost early on, lost to AK, but he ended up eliminating Chanel as well on his way here. But look at this. We have ourselves a match, ladies and gentlemen. Mm -hmm. The final game between these two. Eddie Gordo versus Afina. Who's going to take it? Only one of these players will move on in the bracket. Absolutely. Let's go. And you mentioned earlier, a $1,000 difference between this third and fourth place. Yeah, this match here is for $1,000. That's crazy. $1,000 first to one. Allow it. Let's go. <laughs> Perfect. Nice. Oh, good stuff from Arslan. And see, that's the difference of, of having the walls in play because he wasn't able to get away from the Mantis pressure. Uh, and, and that's the thing, right? And no break on the 1 plus 2. You said it yourself, Mark. People haven't been testing his throw breaking. Gonna go to the wall. Hey, 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 hey. Big pressure. Oh, Arson is awake now. What are Damn. you gonna do? How is Sir gonna deal with this? He's made adjustments time and again throughout the entire weekend, but is this his last stand? Mm. He's put it into a tough, two. very tough position right now. Tough predicament. Oh, that's big. He gets the launch. Yep, caught him ducking. Nice low. Oh, trying to go for the back hole catch. Oh, yeah, yeah, be careful. He's dead. Mmm, Arslan now on set. Point to eliminate, sir. The crazy run he has had. Is it going to end here? Okay. 
Back on two. Ooh. Ay, he doesn't know. Ooh, caught up, hands head down three. The spring. Mm -hmm. Ooh. The mid. I'm not going to get the wall though. Still in the middle of the stage. Set on the back foot. Oh, he got Damn caught. It. He might be done. Oh, he's <laughs> alive. And that's going to be a, a little mini pop off there from Arslan Ash, but <laughs> the sad face there from Sir. The sad antics. boys. <laughs> you gotta give you it know. up though. This guy oh, played man. insane throughout the entire weekend, getting fourth place here.